This is a message for Bridger. Hey, Bridger. Captain America here. How you doing, buddy? So, uh, so I read your story. I saw what you did. Now, I'm sure you've heard a lot of this over the last couple of days, but let me be the next one to tell you, pal, you're a hero. What you did was so brave, so selfless. Your sister is so lucky to have you as a big brother. Your parents must be so proud of you. I'm going to track down your address and I'm going to send you an authentic Captain America shield because, pal, you deserve it. Keep being the man you are. We need people like you. Hang in there. I know recovery might be tough, but based on what I've seen, I don't think there's much that can slow you down. Bye, buddy. Bridger, you're a rock star. My name is Robert Downey Jr. I played Coney. Makes me an old friend of Caps. I hear he sent a shield your way. I'm going to do one better. You call me on your next birthday. I got something special for you. Late. By the way, that's a promise. Promise needs a shield. <laughs> it's you. My best friend in the whole wide world. You know I'm calling you today? Uh, tell me everything. It's 100 days until voting time. No. Yes. So you have to convince me to vote. And I have to convince you to vote. And all friends need to convince their friends to vote. I am a voter. Today is a uh, hashtag register a friend. Is you need to encourage all your other friends to vote as well. I'm going to do whatever you say. Uh, you can text friends to 26797 to register and receive updates. I'm going to tag 10 friends. We're going to meet this goal. That's perfect. What else important are you doing today? You're selling vagina candles? What are you up to? Oh, wait. Okay, good. And, I made you uh, a I'm... new candle. It's it's just for you. It smells like my taint, and it's going to be... <laughs> You're too much. That would be correct. <laughs> wow, well, dude, you've got good taste. What movie are you watching Great right taste. now? Yeah, what movie's on, on your TV right now? Spider Man. No, wait, which one? Homecoming. Oh, you're, a, you're even more of a hero now. <laughs> what, which one do you prefer? Do you prefer the first one or the second one? Second. That's always a good goal for us, is to try and make the second one better than the first one. We're going to be shooting Spider-Man 3, and if you ever want to come to set and hang out, see the Spider-Man suit up close and hang out with us, you're always welcome. You'll always be my guest. You That's can go thing. see them make a Spider-Man movie. He just invited you. For real, bud. Oh he's, he's really starstruck, but thank you so much. <laughs> you should be so proud of yourself. Okay, next question. Uh, so this is uh, from uh, B. Valenzuela. Uh, during this unprecedented time, what was your form of entertainment during quarantine? Were you able to improve or pick up a new skill? Uh, during quarantine, I had uh, my, my younger brother, Scott, with me out here in Massachusetts, and, uh, and we just became children again. I mean, we kind of are anyway, um, but, but it was a lot, of, uh, a lot of games, a lot of competition. We played uh, in, uh, ping pong and uh, soccer, tennis, and wiffle ball. We, we went on a lot of hikes. I got, I got a bunch of hikes near my house, so we would take my dog on hikes, some mountain biking. Um, it was actually really great. It was nice. I mean, we're both, we're both news junkies, so it was you know near impossible to separate our experience from what was going on on a global scale, but uh, you know, Mario Kart helped. Okay, next question. Uh, Stephanie Likes TV asks, uh, will you keep us updated on Dodger's surgery and recovery and post more photos of him on Instagram? Uh, also, is there anything you still want to accomplish with ASP that you haven't already? What are the next steps? Uh, yes, I will keep you updated on Dodger. Um, so sad, is his hip, he was limping a couple years ago and took him to the vet and, and he said it was just, you know, arthritis. Um, they did x-rays. Um, you know what they found? There was a BB, a BB in his hip. He was a street dog in, in Savannah and a 
so just well well um somebody shot him some punk uh anyway uh uh they said his hip was not great but you know you don't want to you don't want to do surgery unnecessarily so we waited a couple years switched up his diet anti-inflammatories and then he started limping again and they were just like look it's time to do it time to do it he's he's young enough he'll recover fast so yeah that's that's happening next week and i think he's gonna i think he's gonna cruise through recovery um Next part of that question was, is there anything you still want to accomplish? Um, yeah, of course. I mean, I, I think there's, I think there's, there's a lot of applications, even with the mechanism of, of exploring any topic really, uh, through the eyes of the people with experience in that arena. So I'm excited about thinking about where this could uh, expand, but, 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 you know, one thing at a time for now. Uh, yeah, yeah.
blah 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 blah